What's up, everyone? Very good evening to you guys in the US. Um, you know, I think uh, UK, Canada, thank you so much for watching, guys. Um, I think the whole market is starting to pick up a little bit. Bitcoin is already at 1,942, um, you know, and, and, and I'm using Coinergy for my charting. So, you know, if you are interested in, uh, you know, uh, doing up charts and also, uh, you know, having a small referral fee for each time someone signs up with Coinergy, um, have a look at the description below. This is where uh, the charting tool is from. Okay, so let's take a look at what's been happening um, in the markets. Okay, so I did a video about Ripple a few days, I think two days ago. And um, yeah, um, so Ripple, uh, I, I did mention that if you had a good run up already, uh, you know, try to avoid it. And true enough, it's starting to sell down pretty strong. All right, it could bounce, right? Because um, there are a lot of elements in play here. And, uh, you know, there are people asking, you know, should I, should I go, go back in, you know? My advice to people who want to go back in, look for consolidation. As of now, if you look at the daily candles, it's still being sold down very heavily. Now, if you look at the hourly candles, okay, what do the hourly candles tell you? Okay, the hourly candle can tell you that it's already a, a flag, right? But with more downside pressure than upside. Okay, so this is, this is a pennant flag. All right, and um, yeah, it looks like it has, uh, you know, it looks like it has a, a more downside pressure than upside. So my advice is not to look at just the, okay, it depends on your strategy. Are you looking at very long term or you're looking at very short term? If you're looking at very short term, currently now it's being sold down. Um, you know, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't touch it. And I mentioned in my videos, I, I will not touch it because I already miss the boat, right? If you let's go back to the one day, why did I say I missed the boat? I said I wanted to go in on the third of May. Okay, third of May is around here. These these three candles. Okay, see fourth, see fourth. Okay, it's a bit laggy now, so um, bear with me. So fourth of May. Okay, uh, this is 29th of April. There was a small consolidation here, and then you have the run up, right? So that was around 400 percent or so. So you know, um, I I missed it. I'm not going to go into it. Whether you, you want to go into it, I leave that to you. Okay, now next are uh, the three coins that I actually did mention pretty strongly was ETC, uh, uh, LTC, and, um, and Gollum, GNT. So let's just look at, you know, the various coins. Uh, what, how have they been doing? Well, for, I would say for, uh, you know, for ETC, it's being suppressed. Okay, it's being suppressed. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> if you if you bought it around the the uh around the sell down period, which is the thirty one, the thirty one range. Okay. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's it's definitely worth more now to the dollar because Bitcoin has appreciated, right? So at that point, when this happened. Okay, Bitcoin was about thousand eight, close to thousand nine, and now, uh, you know, as you can see, right, there's always these people are selling off to each other. This is a one hour candle, right? Can you see that this happens, and then after there's a sell down. So, obviously, the person who buys it up is selling to himself. Same thing here, same thing here, same thing here, same thing here. Okay, so he, this is like a vacuum. Okay, it's like a vacuum. So if it if, if the, the person is buying up and then selling down, same thing, all the action will happen at uh, uh, 350,000 Satoshis. So the, they will have the buy up, the buy up, buy up, and then after you have a sharp sell down. This will rinse and repeat until, basically it's to create panic. Okay, Basically it's to keep, create panic because the person wants to accumulate, or at least a group of people want to accumulate around the $6 range. Okay. So just want to let you know this is what's happening with ETC and it's also being suppressed, all right. And how I can how I can uh, probably try to prove it is that um, okay. So you look at the you look at the buy and sell walls, okay. So as you can see, it's very obvious that um, at point uh, uh, three hundred fifty thousand satoshis you have a very thick uh, sell wall, and yeah, here again. 
and here. So you don't have that thick, nice thick buy wall yet from the general markets. These are it's it's gonna you know go up and down, go up and down until probably Emerald is gonna be launched. Okay, so I don't really care too much. I'm very long term into ETC, right? But uh, if you're asking me whether you, could you go in now. I wouldn't say it's the best price. I'm looking at recollecting at point uh zero zero point zero zero three one or zero point uh or three hundred thousand satoshis flat. I don't mind getting in, but it's not cheap anymore because BTC is now one thousand nine hundred forty two. Okay, so or one thousand nine if you look at your your wallets. Okay, and it's not cheap anymore, right? It used to be like. This level, uh, where if you're looking at uh three hundred thousand satoshis, it's about six dollars, uh, uh, five six dollars flat, five five dollars flat. Now it's almost close to six dollars, right? So it's not like that fantastically cheap anymore. It's six dollars a pop for your etc. And there you go. Can you see the bump up? Yeah. So yeah, it's gonna happen. Okay, it's gonna sell down very sharply, and people will get all upset. They start releasing their ETC and rinse repeat, you know. So I'm just keeping it chill. I'm not doing anything. I just hold everything in cold storage. Now, now uh, LTC. Let's see what's happening with LTC. Now LTC. Okay, I'm sorry guys, lagging again. LTC uh, is having a good run. Uh, I'll show you the results later. Okay, uh, I did a small experiment starting out with very little. Um, putting everything in Exodus IO and if let's say for example, I mentioned that if you don't want to touch Trading you just want to buy and sell and hold you can um, get some uh, Returns as well, right? And you just do simple buying and selling through your Exodus IO which has a shape shift uh, Exchange uh, inbuilt into it and you can yeah, you can make some money there You can do your holding you can do your little bit of trading there But of course the spreads are not fantastic, but that's a very good way for people to start out Okay, so anyway, um, LTC has already broke the 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 fourteen thousand uh, uh, uh sorry one point four uh one point four three million Satoshi mark, and uh, of course now let's see whether it can even hold above this uh because this is a one hour chart right so let's go to the one day. The one day uh you know can't really tell us anything as of now. It's just showing that okay, you know, it's kind of recovering, but there could be a uh resistance at the the sixteen thousand uh one point six a million Satoshi mark. So let's let's just see. Right? Just now it was at one point five uh there was one point five million uh Satoshis, but it's gradually picking up. Now uh Litecoin, like I said, I, I picked it up around the low, guys. <clears throat> I, I, I did mention if you look back at the video. I picked it up at the low, around uh eleven uh one one point one mil and uh one point two mil satoshis. I picked it up around there. Okay, so just letting it ride. Um, I why did I look look at it because I looked at it from the fact that it was consolidating. It has been sold down, and 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 people were not uh taking profit from Ripple. For me, I missed Ripple. I decided to go into uh ETC. LTC and GNT now coming to GNT. So GNT so far seems to be a very very good play um, I didn't catch it entirely at the low here. I picked it up around here Okay, so this is the one hour hourly chart. So I picked it up around 11,000 to 12,000 Satoshis Okay, so I picked it up around here and uh, now it seems to have broken the <clears throat> it seems to have broken the the uh thirteen thousand satoshi mark thirteen thousand four hundred thirteen thousand five hundred satoshi um but this is an hourly so let's not get too excited yet um this would be the previous support right support come resistance so i would assume that through the day there would be some sell downs towards this level and uh, let's see at the end of the day how they're gonna fare now let's look at the one day uh, okay, so yeah, so the one day you you see a very very strong buy up, you know, it, it like I said right, it's been suppressed, BTC strength, ripple action, all here, and now it's starting to pick back up again, and yeah, right, so right on, so far two counts, uh, ETC is so so, now let's go back to our little project. 
Now I told the audience or my subscribers that you can start with very little, keep it very simple. So my base coins, my base currencies were Bitcoin and Ethereum. And uh, I can prove to you that I did not, you know, rebuy or anything. Okay, now this, these little things that are coming in, um, I will explain. Okay, these are very recent. Okay, these are very recent. So I'll explain that later. Now, Ethereum, as you can see, my last received was 17 of May. I bought, I started buying coins up uh, around this period as well. Okay, so, so I just bought and I exchanged, you know, here a little bit here and there, but these are just buy and hold. I'm not doing anything. They're just there. Okay, they're just there to create a portfolio. Just in case if I want to buy something with Ethereum, I could. And just in case I want to buy something with Bitcoin, I can. Same thing. So I did the Gollum buy. As you can see, I did on the 15th of, of May. I bought Gollum. So what what was the result? 15th of May, it came in at 6, 691. I hope that you guys can see. Let me increase the let me increase the, the, the size a little bit so that... Oh, no, I can't. Okay, let me increase the, the size. Okay, so uh, I hope you guys can see uh, 691 was the value. Now it's worth 848. Just a simple buy and hold and knowing when to go in. Right? Here, same thing. I bought LTC. Uh, on the 16th, it was worth 554. Now it's worth 710. So that's um, a, almost $200 profit on top. See? So you don't have to have a lot of money. You just have to have like a decent sum at the right point then you won't have to panic because i see people commenting oh can i go into uh ripple now you're chasing you know you're, you're just thinking that there's this very sharp consolidation uh there's this sharp retracement and you think that it's an entry point wait for consolidation before making that decision i waited for consolidations i wait for heavy sell downs for for a series of days, even weeks, if I have to, and wait for a, a, a like a little, like a little turn, like a up, like a little turn back to the upside, trying to retest the 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 support levels that were broken, and then I'll make a decision. For very very uh you know for for clear signals means that the the support level is broken then you 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 actually enter the position but i think those are for margin traders where they they have they want to have that swing or that that clear uptrend uh before but i'm just i'm investing i put my money in at the right points and that's all i do so it's very very straightforward now back to um these little payouts right okay these little payouts i i mentioned in my previous video where i use crypto programs right i have a list of crypto programs that you can uh, check out in the description so these crypto programs um, help me to earn Bitcoins or Ethereum passively. And um, one honorable mention that I've been using recently um, it pays out 7%. It is, I would say, high risk. Um, but, you know, nonetheless, it's pretty good, right? So this is called Bitcoin Brains. It has a very nice, uh, cool dashboard, right? And they, 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 they claim that they do the trading for you. So... This uh, does 0.3% uh, every hour and pays out to your balance, right? So when it pays out to your balance, what it does is that um, every four hours, okay, so you can check it out here. So every four hours, right, uh, server time, if you look at the bottom uh, server time, it will pay out to the wallet. So whatever comes in, comes in. And then you once you enter your, your Bitcoin address, um, it will it will automatically pay out. So while I was sleeping, I, I woke up not too long ago and you know I received like these small little payouts. Now, where do these payouts come from? Okay, obviously you can have people who who uh who are, are gonna join your program when they uh, invest as well, you get a small commission, I think like five percent or something. It's nothing fantastic. I'm just using it as a passive income, but also the fact that they pay out 0.3% hourly or 7.2% per day, um, it's pretty good. You can just use it and um, your break-even point will be 14 days later. And uh, yeah, so about 13.8 days. So let's just take it as 14 days later. You That's where your break-even, you get back your seed money 
and uh, you can allow the profits to to run i mean you don't have to do anything guys everything is automated because they they send the withdrawals to you automatically once you put in your bitcoin address you make a deposit all right it will reflect here and then from then you know your balance uh whatever that you earn referral commissions or earnings will be will be here because your hourly earnings are paid here your referral commissions are paid here every four hours the system checks and they say oh okay there's a balance it will send it uh send it out to your bitcoin address directly and here you go see you can see how much you earn for referral commission so yeah guys so take a look uh whatever strategy you decide to do is your choice right you want to go into the markets directly make sure you have um, a good enough cash flow if you don't have uh enough cash flow perhaps um, these kind of programs could help you out to give you a little bit of a boost right um yeah and other than that you know have fun right today is already friday there should be some selling down all these are you know all these are not going to be as fantastic because uh it's thursday or probably on your side but it's friday here today so asian markets will be opening uh in in another two hours uh here japan korea will start to to wake up and china as well so who knows how the day will end um you know right now as i say uh it's it's okay you know it's uh, 3532 i started out below 3000 2000 if you look look back at my videos it was starting at about 228 2800 so i made about 700 dollars not too bad for a buy and hold strategy right so yep so check out the list of uh, crypto programs that i use uh, feel free to join them. Nonetheless, always invest with money that you can afford. And also, if you have not, uh, you know, subscribed to my channel, please feel free to subscribe. Um, at the same time, also, I am uh, creating a better camera fund. You know, if you feel that I've I've been value adding to you, giving you sound advice, giving you, um, you know, advice that can help you reach your wealth, your wealth, accu uh, you know, create more wealth. Um, yeah, you know, tip me a little bit here and there because, like I said, I don't make anything from YouTube. It's just basically value adding to you guys. All right. So thanks for so much for watching. Uh, and uh, and also just remember to like, um, dislike, comment, and last but not least, subscribe. Cheers and have a good weekend, guys.